Hi, welcome. In this session, let us talk about test discovery with PyTest. I am Kumar and welcome to my channel on tech and tutorials. So we already have few number of test files. We have test module 1, module 2 and inside Py assertions we have another test module, test module 01. So let us open our command prompt. So let us go to the explorer. You can right click on this uh, PyTest topic and from PyCharm you can go to explorer which is going to open my windows explorer and then from this folder you can just type cmd and we should be getting our command prompt just minimize this one so in our command prompt we need to enable the virtual environment so for that we have venv scripts and activate this will enable the python 384 which is our virtual environment for our project so coming back to our discovery we can just type pytest here and what this is going to do is it is going to search inside this pytest automation folder and it's going to start searching all the files in the name of test and it's going to run all those files and it's going to search for all the functions which for which the name starts with test again here so let us try to run that and see what happens okay so it is done here you see three failed and seven passed we have totally around 10 test cases totaling from all of these files if you just see here we have two in this module two and here we have five seven and here we have three years so totally with 10 tests we have and three are failed which we have failed intentionally and yeah three tests are there which we are trying to fail intentionally just to see the output so you can also do the same thing here verbose mode and you should be seeing the same with more detailed put here so you can see here which are the tests got passed and failed with the minus v option so this is how you can run from the main folder and it will search in that folder and its subdirectories and try to run all the test files and then each of those test functions that is one way of running the pi test next let us see how to run we have seen how to run a single file using the folder name pi test topic inside that we can if we want to run only test underscore module 01 which we have already seen earlier we can do that and we have seen how to run a single file and the other thing is we can also run the whole folder so if i run the pi test topic it is going to run these two files and the pi assertions inside this pi assertions folders is going to recursively go and search all the files and folders inside pi test topic so i'm not going to do that i'm going to run only the test which are under pi assertions this is going to run only the single file test underscore module 01. So if I hit enter, so the pi underscore assertion is having five tests. So you can see here pi test topic pi assertion. This only four, only the five tests which are inside the pi assertions folder. And then uh, we have only one test module test underscore module 01. And those tests only will run. You can run it by a single directory or folder. Next, we can also run with the class name a test class test my stuff we can run only the single class file so for that what we need to do is we need to specify the test underscore module 02 and we have to specify the class name so if we just want to run our only uh, this single class this would be helpful for example if you have multiple class in your single module then this might be helpful but let me show you here you can do like this the whole path to the module or the file and you can put the uh, class name and this is going to run only the tests which are inside this class there are only two tests here so it's going to run only those two tests you can see those are the only two tests which got ran for this session other thing is you can also specify only the test function which you want to run for example i just want to run this this one is failed so we'll use this one test string and paste it here and this is going to run only this single test yeah so this is how you can run your single test so you can do the same thing for the module without this one's with the test class but you can do the same thing for the module without the test class also it's like the same way of running say for example i want to run test underscore a1 only so what i can do is i can provide this in the test module one 
and then colon colon test underscore a1 and this one's going to just run that single test test underscore one and you see that it ran only the test underscore one this is helpful if you wanted to debug uh, running a single test instead of running the full test file the whole test file if it has many tests and all this is helpful when you are starting to write a test and you are trying to debug uh, that test and of course you can also run it from pycharm you can just put your cursor on this test name and right click and you can run it from here also this is also going to run this single test this is also helpful that's pretty much about the test discovery since i have named all my test using the test underscore and that's why my pytest is able to search all these test files and run there are ways to alter these discovery rules if you have a bunch of tests named differently and uh, you, you can actually change that in the config also there are other ways of test discovery and all using the markers we will also see that in the next a later session you can also run using test markers and again you can also run using the test name using the option minus k in pytest so those are the other things which we will see but for now i think this is good to start with pytest the default discovery rules for pytest so that's all in this session hope it was helpful to you thanks a lot for watching